so hi dear uh, taurus a very very good evening to you guys this is anjali tarot and this is a general love reading for all the taurus sun moon venus rising keep in mind this is general it might or might not resonate with you at the first place the second thing this is a reading from 20 till the 28th of feb from today till the end of feb and this is general this is not for everyone please keep that in mind this is for singles whosoever consider themselves single for whatever reason let's see the overall energy for taurus people for this week <clears throat> Knight of Swords, sudden unexpected changes are going to happen in your love life in this coming week. Suddenly, you can expect some kind of sudden communication, sudden message, sudden growth or sudden stoppage. It's, something, sudden, something is happening here that is very, very sudden for you that you might not be able to cope up with, but you cannot change it. It is sudden unexpected kind of communication or situation happening, sudden fast forward moment. Something is happening here that is very sudden and unexpected. Let's see in the recent past what was happening. Temperance card. So Taurus, in the recent past, you were trying your best to be as patient with yourself, as patient with other people as you could. Right? You were trying to balance your emotions, trying to balance your temper, trying to slow down in your life, especially in your love life, because you were in this energy of not finding a balance in your life. You were very confused. You were very imbalanced. You were very impatient about a particular person or situation in your life. And if you are single from a very long time, you were just frustrated because you were meeting all the people of the universe, but you were not able to connect with anybody. In some cases, it was very, it, it, is, it is very much possible that you were trying to force a connection or force a situation with somebody and they were not liking it. <clears throat> okay. So that's why it forced you to change your uh, ways of, uh, about love, about the thinking, about uh, relationships and this kind of stuff. Okay, let's see what is the current energy. Five of Cups. Taurus, right now you are feeling lonely and sad and depressed kind of. It is happening in your energies because you are still carrying the past energies, part, past pain with you. Right? You are not able to see the love that is present in, in your life, behind you, just behind you. You are so much focused on the negative portion of your love life. You are like, nobody loves me, nobody takes care of me, I don't love anybody. I'm not able to anybody new. I'm not able to open up to anybody new because I am still stuck on somebody from my past. I'm talking on your behalf. So you are still stuck and kind of depressed. You are still very much depressed about something or someone here, feeling very lonely and sad. And actually, it's not uh, it's not depression and loneliness. Uh, uh, it it's not that much of uh, loneliness or depression. As it is regret or guilt about something or someone. You have, you have certain kind of regrets and guilt about a certain person or certain situation in your life. And you are not able to let it go. No matter how you are hard you are trying to do this, you are not able to let it go. Let's see what your energies are for your new, for a new person. Nine of Pentacles. Okay, somebody stable is uh, willing to come in your life. Somebody who is stable, like money-wise stable, financially stable, uh, otherwise also stable. This is the best night when it comes to the nights in the tarot deck. This is the best night because it is stable. This is somebody who thinks a lot before they doing anything. So it could be possible that somebody is coming towards you with uh, honesty and truth and loyalty. That uh, And somebody has the potential to become a very strong connection in the future. But you are kind of stuck in a past situation. That is why you are not able to uh, recognize this uh, particular um, opportunity. Or you are just throwing this opportunity out of your life. Or you are simply feeling too stuck. To go ahead with your life but yes there is a good chance that somebody who is very much interested in you and somebody who is kind of loyal also and stable also coming your way this week i think this person is not very rich but this person is fin financially stable also that is a good sign taurus virgo capricorn let's see what is coming towards you with the from a past level or past energies Five of Swords, okay, okay. I think somebody is coming towards you to manipulate you to have this mind games and some some kind of uh, uh, cheating is going on, manipulation, mind games. Somebody is coming towards you for a fight, for an ego battle or something. Somebody who's a big time manipulator, somebody who used to uh, used to manipulate you all the time. I think this person is coming towards you from a, a past person is coming towards you with some kind of manipulations, mind games and some kind of uh, blame games also. Somebody from your past is coming towards you but not with a very good energy to be honest. Wow. 
somebody is too egoistic to uh, accept their faults and they are going to fight with you because their ego is not letting them uh, letting them to let you go but at the same time this is somebody who wants to fight with you because they have a very high ego i feel somebody is coming towards you to create some kind of drama to get some kind of attention to get some kind of uh, uh, reaction from your side and i think you are giving up on this you are like no i'm done i'm done you, they are not getting any reaction from your side so that's why might be they are going to create some kind of drama could be possible let's see what is the guidance for you 10 of swords so taurus the guidance for you is that whatever is done is done you should not go back to the past again and again and you should not dictate your a uh, life's purpose or life's goals just because something happened with you in the past and you are not able to get out of that situation you have to get up and you have to start working on yourself you have to start seeing things from a different perspective from a different direction you have learned all the lessons of the universe taurus okay now it is the time to accept uh, the truth the way it is without manipulating it and don't try to fix the past it's it's done it's gone you don't have to do anything about it you just have to keep moving forward with with honesty with truthfulness yes it is quite painful right now but trust me with time everything is going to be fine but i do see a beautiful lover a beautiful situation coming your way if you allow it to because you are still hurt so you are still creating some kind of uh, energies of uh, negativity around you so that's why you are blocking a, a new person from coming towards you my goodness so yeah thank you so much for tuning in taurus i'll see you soon in the next video bye bye take care god bless you namaste